So you've pretty much been on the road since you started. What do you think the do's and don'ts that you've learned over the course of the last like 20 years? Never call home and act like you're having fun. Your wife will hate you. Don't give that, that away. Is, don't give that away. Uh, can we not play this everywhere so that yeah. they don't see this eventually? You always have to sound like you're miserable on the road. Uh, do you guys remember the first time that you performed on the Grand Ole Opry stage? Uh, I do. Probably, yeah. 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 It had to do with little Jimmy Dickens. Because <laughs> uh, we performed and we finished our first single, Praying for Daylight, like our third or fourth song we did. And, Came off stage and came back in one of these rooms back here for the Toronto was. It looked a lot different back then, 18 years ago. And knock on the door, and it's little Jimmy Dickens. He said, he said an expletive I can't say, but he said, you <laughs> boys are really good. Thumbs up, it's like, wow, little Jimmy Dickens just gave us a thumbs up and said we're really good. That's wow. amazing. Yeah. And then usually there's a, a, a wax figure of little Jimmy Dickens sitting right here. Uh, yeah. Right. Yeah. This was his room. Uh, how have you guys been doing the studio stuff while on the road? Yeah, it's been a combination <laughs> of things. We've been cutting on our days off back in town. And we've also been, you know, literally doing work on the road, like with the laptop out on the bus, you know, doing overdubs and editing and, you know, sending files back and forth to Nashville and just every spare moment we can being hunkered down trying to finish it. It's been a long summer. Ten studio albums, number one after number one. You've got the new single, Back to Life, that's going to be coming out. Mm -hmm. Why this song? You know, th this song just kind of seemed to uh, melodically just just kind of stand above it because it's different, and you know, it's a waltz with that great success with a, with a six eight, and but this it just kind of melodically was different, and loved the story. The lyric is great, you know. I think we've all got people in our lives that who bring us back to life and pull us up when we're going under, you know? You know, the story was great and melodically we just it was just one of those things that we had to we had to grab hold of and we, we couldn't wait to sing it and it just we're excited about it. Let's go back, you know, eighteen years or so. Do you remember that first big paycheck that came? What did you guys go and spend? What was that first big purchase? I, mine, I paid off a credit card that I had since I was like 17. Then I just, oh, it was terrible. That was the only way, that was the only godsend because I'd still be paying like $22 a month for the rest of my life. I remember where we were when we got our first royalty check from the, uh, the record label. We were at Randy Goodman's house, who was the president of Lyric Street at the time, and he pulled us around the corner and had Xerox copies of the, uh, the royalty check in envelopes that he handed each of us and shook our hands and congratulated us. And I uh, went and bought a uh, new car. I hadn't ever had a new car before. So I bought a Nissan Xterra that was promptly stolen on Britney's birthday. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you left it running though. I had it, I know. I had, well, no, I just left the keys, <laughs> left in, it. keys in it. What do we see for the rest of 2018 and going into 2019 for you guys? You know, we're gonna finish the Back to Us tour. And, and uh, sleep. And sleep. And sleep. And then, uh, you know, we're. We're always on the hunt for great songs, and we've got some more that we've cut that are in the can, and we're possible duet coming out maybe next year. Oh, so. Look at that tease. Yeah. Look yeah. at that. Well, Rascal Flats, thank you guys so much for a few minutes. Thank totally you for having us. Totally appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. And right here in the Grand Ole Opry.